Well, hello, ladies and germs, and welcome back to the park. We are back in this amazing... somber, creepy amusement park that we've decided to come back into to find our son's teddy bear, Callum. His name is, if you're just wondering, if you haven't caught up. Um... And now we're at the roller coaster. Mommy is coming, Callum. Which, by the looks of it, we're I going to, to ride. This one. Never got ride. to do it before. Is there a reason for that? Hmm. Hmm. Is that the? That's the carriage there. Okay. Are we going to see our friend again with the tall hat? I don't know who he is. I don't know whether he's... Is he going to be there? Hello? Oh, hi! What do you want? We who? need to talk about Callum. What do you mean? What have you done to him? I? That's insulting. You and your boy are everything that this place doesn't want. The antithesis of what we stand for. Where is Callum? Is he behind me? The poor child. He tried so hard to do what he was taught. He even left you a trail of breadcrumbs. But the park is just so hungry. Tell me where my son is. Oh, Which has that's now? creepy. Has both of you. No happy ending here, I'm afraid. Just, In my, just leave me alone. In my headphones, he is like literally Fool. here. You always were. Oh. Mm. What did that say? Hello? Do you guys know what happened there? Because I don't. So that was flashbacks of a hospital. And something to do with Callum. And our friend Mr. Tallhat telling us about us being here is making it more of a problem? It works. The calculations and adjustments work. Work, duh. The, trans the transport and storage mechanisms seem to be flawless. What a wonderful day. If only these people knew what they what they were fueling and so what if a few people leave the park at the end of the day, feeling door. Feeling door? So, what if the children are more scared than excited on the roller coaster? This could be the doorway to emotion, emotion, immortality. And such doorways open only to those who have the will to find the key. Right. Okay. Mm. Lovely. Number one, I'm not liking those noises in my ear at all. I'm really not. Um, and I'm sorry, but I'm going to go back to it again. What's with the hospital? Why are we having flashbacks of that? This is interesting because now this seems to be opening up a whole new can of worms of what is actually going on with this game. Um... Okay. I'm not playing anymore, Callum. Oh, now we get a flashlight. Jeez, come on. 
the witch awaits. I'm sorry, what? Well, the Hansel and Gretel witch? How can I turn Come this? Back! Can I? Don't let him take me. Who? Callum, I'm not playing around anymore, buddy. Callum has bruises on his arms, finger marks. Someone has been hurting him. I've asked him, demanded really, to know where he got the marks. But he doesn't want to answer me. Something has scared him into silence. He doesn't dare talk. He's been changing too. Something sinister lurks in the darkness behind his eyes. I catch him staring at me at odd moments. In the night, he tosses and turns and cries out words that I cannot understand. When I try to soothe him, he snaps and bites at my fingers. I think he wants to talk to me. I think he wants to tell me. But they are watching him every minute of every day. They are whispering to him in his sleep, changing him. They are taking my baby away from me. I can save him. There will be pain. But I love him, and in the end, he will understand why. Okay, I'm sorry, what, but what is actually going on right now? Like, this, this, this has turned, turned into a whole new... Different of law... Difference of law that I thought was going on because I thought I'd just come in here to find your son, Callum, and to find his teddy bear and go home and have a nice, you know, comfy evening around a campfire. Campfire? Around a fire? Open fire? You know, popcorn, maybe some schmores or something to relax Callum? ourselves. Callum! Callum, can oh, you... Number one... Maybe I don't want to follow the recommers. Number two, what the frick is coming out of that speaker right there? I can help you, Callum. And number three. Keep them away from me. Who? Where's my flashlight? I just picked up a flashlight. I want to use my flashlight. Please. Dear sir. Can't go up there. Don't really want to anyway because of that weird squeaky noise. Okay. This isn't a game, Callum! So we're going back to the Hansel and Gretel story. Interesting. And now we're down to side shit. Sideshow Alley. I'm not liking these noises I can hear in my headphones. Hello. I come in peace. I think. Hi. Callum, where are you? Can I call you Cal? For sure. Pickled punks. That's a that's a doctor's table. That's a surgery table. Why is that there? Callum, can you tell me? I'm not playing anymore, Callum. The whole town was shocked by that one. Never found out who did it. Mommy, I'm scared. I'm sorry, who? I didn't even get time to read that newspaper clipping because there was someone in me ear. Oh. Well, sorry, guys. We can't seem to read that now. Oh. Will you stop this? That looks like a blood splatter. Cotton candy. Am I going this way? Uh, Come back. Uh, what? Mm, 
No. Poor bastard. Who did this to him? Well, who is it? Who is this man, woman, person, thing who's on the floor? And why is there a clown face there? Okay, we're going to walk up. Jesus crime <laughs> Oh, Chad, you son of a bitch. You son of a... Oh. Well, there you go. First recorded jump scare on my camera. <laughs> uh, this isn't a game, Callum. Callum, mate, I'm telling you now, buddy, I'm getting irritated now. Where you gone? Where am I going? I can help you, Callum. Oh, there's something there now. Of course there is. The, these are mine. Oh, okay, it's a tattoo of the husband. Okay. Uh, okay. What is happening? Are you better off than you were four years ago? Fear the boogeyman. Stop picking your nose then. Ha 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 ha. Ah, don't believe anything they tell you. Fuck gravity, of course. What does that say? Something is a fat pig, but his daughter is hot. Right. It's not safe. The League. I can taste your dreams. I beg your pardon. Your mother. Say no to gravity. Some kids laugh and some kids cry, but mostly children simply die. I I don't understand what's happening anymore. All that you love will be carried away. 1980s, apparently. Well, I can't go this way. Chad, I'm telling you now, mate. Like, seriously, you almost gave me a heart attack as well. Like, come on. What does that say? Destroy reality. Why would you want to do that? No, thank you. Only dead fish follow the stream. I can hear a clown. I don't want to hear a clown. Oh, hello. I've taken some form of psychedelic pills, haven't I? You, young man. <coughs> Just realised I hit my camp, my microphone there. You, you can know. Hello, sir. Uh, maybe I don't want to. Okay, that's just... Okay. Um... Teddy bears. That's why we came here, right? Was to find Callum's bear? Is that Callum's bear in the corner there? Hello? Oh, okay. Hi, hello, friends. Don't touch me. I beg your pardon. <laughs> oh, hell no, man. There was something there. What was there? Okay, this is starting to trip me out a bit now. What is going on here? That's... Pickled punks again. 
Okay, I'm going out this way now, am I? Park is a collage of contradictions all of its own. Millions of people die every year in car crashes. And the park has little cars designed specifically to simulate that action. Hear the children scream with joy. In the sideshow alley, you can walk away with 15 cents worth of mass-produced Chinese teddy bears while a grinning carny pockets your hard-earned five dollars. And what secrets lie beneath the sullen waters of the lake? The tears of jilted lovers, the oh. soiled condoms of illicit affairs, I... the clotted blood of the lonely suicide. Beg your pardon. And the face of the witch looms over it all. I always despised her toothy grin and warty nose. I hate that sparkle in her weathered, watchful eyes. I think Callum is waiting for me inside. Callum? Callum! Keep them away. Oh, Callum. <sighs> like I said to you, ladies and germs, beforehand when we started this game, we knew this was going to happen. We knew we were going to end up in this house of horrors, which is the last place that we need to go. Oh, Cal. Why did you have to end up in here, bro? Ah. Oh. I don't no. No, 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 no. Okay, we're gonna have to, obviously. We're gonna have to. Okay, fine. Cool. We'll leave that there, ladies and germs. Um I hope you enjoyed and thank you again for tuning in. Uh but as always, please obviously leave a like, subscribe, comment on the channel. Uh please, if you do enjoy what you're watching, please, it, it means a lot to your support of what you do for this channel again. Um, but thank you again guys for watching uh, and I will see you all in the next video. Cheers.